In this video, I'm going to show you the goal of the IPC Training and Certification Program. So stay tuned. My name is Ramon Essos and I'm from ETEC Trainingen. In this first video, we're going to talk about the IPC Training and Certification Programs. If you're not familiar with the IPC Training and Certification Programs, We'll put a link down in the description below with more information. IPC training and certifications play a key role in bringing value to the electronics industry. These training and certification programs are built around IPC standards, developed and approved by the industry and are delivered in a classroom setting by IPC certified trainers. Upon successful completion of the training and testing, the student is issued an industry traceable certification in one of the following IPC standards. The J standard 001, A610, A620 and the A600 and the 771121. So there is not only one certification program, but there are more certification programs. The programs will train, test and certify in the correct application of the criteria for all acceptance classes. So within the IPC training and certification programs, there are three levels of certification. The first level of certification is the Certified IPC Specialist, also called CIS. The CIS training and certification is appropriate for any individual that will benefit by having a consistent understanding of the criteria in a standard. Line operators, engineers, quality engineers will find this training and certification beneficial to their knowledge in the electronics industry. Separate CIS credentials are required for each certification program. The program will train, test and certify in the correct application of the criteria for all acceptance classes. CIS certification may be granted by either a CIT or MIT for that program. CIS training is modular, so technical training committees for each program will define the course modules that are mandatory or optional for that program. Upon successful completion of the mandatory modules, optional modules may be selected as appropriate to support various technology segments. The second level we are going to talk about is the IPC Certified Standard Expert, also called CSE. So what is an IPC Certified Standard Expert? So the Certified Standard Expert, CSE, is a subject matter professional with a high level of knowledge and understanding of a specific IPC standards or a group of standards. So the last level we are going to talk about is the Certified IPC Trainer, also called CIT. So the Certified IPC Trainer programs are intended for those who wish to become certified as an instructor in different IPC specification for the electronics assembly industry. Our Certified IPC Trainer CIT programs are best suited for experienced and skilled electronics technicians, engineers and supervisors who have the will and the passion to teach and train colleagues about the quality standards of IPC. They also provide successful candidates with a credential that confirms their knowledge and understanding of IPC quality systems. So this was our first video about the IPC training and certification programs. So in future videos we're going to explain more in detail about the different IPC training and certification programs. If you have a topic, please leave a comment down below and maybe we will make a video out of this topic. Thank you for watching, don't forget to subscribe and see you next time.